days And those were the good old days Thank you so much for going down memory lane with me. Let me take you back and tell you the story of Crazy Terry. Now you remember me, I mentioned my cousin Michelle Cornell, uh, uh, in previous uh, memory lane bids. That would be uh, Bike Mishaps, excuse me, Bike Mishaps, uh, Cornell Ridge. I believe it was a sad time for me, though, but she was uh, a mention there and maybe a few others uh, along this uh, uh, great uh, uh, memory lane series. But uh, Michelle Cornell, my cousin, I don't know if she dated the guy or it was just a roommate or whatever it was, but the guy's name was Terry. And uh, he was a few fries short of Happy Meal, uh, a few bricks shy of a load. Uh, Michelle was constantly yelling at Terry because he he was constantly doing stupid stuff. And, uh, you know, as uh, as a crazy person would do. Uh, but nonetheless, uh, you know, he was, I don't know, just like I said, a few fries short of a Happy Meal. Um... Terry, uh, when they came over to uh, uh, 910 8th Street there, Southwest Course, like I said, it was my papa and grandma Idabella's home, and then after they had passed on, it was my Aunt Patty's home there for a brief time. Um, so I'm not sure of the dates, you know, but anyway, Michelle and uh, Terry would come over. I'm not sure what Michelle was doing, but uh, uh, Sean and uh, my cousin John Huffman uh, and me, more or less John and Sean because I, you know, I sit back and just kind of just went along with it and laughed. But uh, John and uh, Sean would just go, Terry, you're a retard. Terry, you're a retard. I'm going to get you guys. And Terry would run. Uh, they'd run around the back of the house or whatever, and uh, Terry would, uh, uh, they would uh, set up a rope. Uh, during or uh, there at night or there on A Street there at the house there, uh, there was a fence there on on the left hand side that uh, was uh, uh, um, Tina Munoz's uh, fence there for her to uh, kind of block off her yard in the back. Then uh, on the right hand side was of course if you remember mentioned about Marge Hex. Uh, so Tina Munoz here on the left or here on the left and Marge here on the right. Don't put any confusion on that one. But anyway, uh, they used the fence of Marge's fence to get up onto the uh, to the back of the uh, yard, or it should be the back of the uh, the back roof, so to speak. And uh, of course, Terry would uh, try to catch him or whatever. John and Sean were like, Terry, you're a retard. Urgh, I'm going to get you guys. Well, Terry would go back a little farther because the alleyway, of course, was at the back of the, uh, at the, back of the house uh, there, of course. Um, anyway, he would, excuse me, he, he would go to about three quarters of the way back to the yard and start running, make a running jump or try to make, or make a run for it, try to jump up on top of the roof to get, uh, uh, to get us or get John and Sean and us or me out if you will mostly John and Sean like I said I'm gonna get you guys and John had a big old stick about yay long let's see about yay long pretty big size stick if you will and he kept net he kept hitting at Terry's hands I'm gonna get you guys I'm gonna get you guys he kept tripping and chuck ch ch holes and everything else and he kept he kept saying, I'm going to get you guys. And Michelle kept saying, Terry, would you stop it? You're doing ignorant things and blah, blah, blah. You're just doing ignorant stuff and everything. And, I mean, Michelle was on to him. But, uh, nonetheless, John and Sean were just like, you're each other. I'm going to get you guys. And, uh, more or less, it was just one of those crazy, crazy times. And when I look back on it now, I laugh and get a chuckle. Talking to Michelle, uh, my cousin Michelle recently, she said about 96 or 97, she lived in Canton, Ohio, and uh, Terry was, uh, uh, Terry had ended up uh, uh, beating up a, uh, one of her neighbors, I believe it was, a female neighbor, and uh, he was also trying to stalk her or whatever, and Michelle threatened to kick his ass. Just a classic time to look back on it and kind of laugh about it. I get a chuckle out of it now. <laughs> I sure hope you did as well. I'm gonna get you guys! Thank you so much for going down memory lane with me. I'll catch you next time.